All right, good evening. We are going to hopefully take up as little as your uh, busy time as possible, and we are going to announce the draws for this year's 2022 Autumn Open Mixed Doubles Championship. I'm actually looking forward to this. You? Yes, for sure. Let's go. Uh, we are going to release the first round matches and their start times. There were a total of 26 teams spanning two divisions, so we were very excited about that. Our last turnout was 20 teams, so we have 26, so um, even better than last time. Um, as always, we are going to be very flexible with um, match start times as we proceed through the weekend. Uh, you know, as long as your future opponents um, agree that, hey, I'd rather play at a different time, that's totally fine. We try to make these tournaments a fun weekend. And not just, hey, play your matches and get out of here type thing, right? Mm -hmm. um, so we like to make them a fun a fun weekend. Uh, we are going to leave courts 7 and 8 open to play uh, for members, uh, for people to warm up on, etc. And you can obviously warm up on courts 1 through 6, uh, but we're going to try to leave 7 and 8 open uh, for, for members to be able to play on. Uh, no worries there, um, but we are going to use courts 1 through 6, so that way we can all sit and watch the matches and, instead of there being two um, through the beautiful courts in the woods. I love those courts, but uh, we'll try to keep everybody together, and, and if it doesn't work that way, it doesn't, no biggie. But we are going to plan to leave those courts open, okay? Uh, we have uh, some uh, fun things kind of planned out for, for the weekend in terms of food trucks. So we have two of them on Friday night. There is going to be the Roaming Oyster. And on Saturday, there will be uh, the Greek gals, is that correct? Greek gal yummy. And they serve like gyros? Uh, uh, yes, um, they have everything. Salads, uh, burgers. Uh, I think you even said snow cones or something? Snow cones, ice cream. Okay, yeah. so, so the, a they, have a, they have a variety of things. Yeah, variety. I was going to say broad spectrum, but I like your word better. Um, also, uh, we will have a keg um, of beer as well. For those of you that paid your entry fees, it is free. For those of you that are coming to hang out, hey, a couple bucks donation or, or contribution will uh, be welcomed, uh, but there will be a keg for, for everyone there. We are going to have karaoke and a DJ on Saturday night. So we always have a great time doing karaoke. I know everybody gets loosened up a bit, and the next thing you know, we've got a group of people singing. So it's a pretty fun time. Definitely. Uh, so Friday night we'll have you know the first round matches. There are a few buys, and, and I'll tell you who those buys are uh, here in just a moment. Um, the you know your two two more matches would be probably you know Saturday, and we'll work on times with you guys. So it's a chilled out weekend, and then the finals will be on on Sunday. Now I do want to mention one thing. Um, you probably know I, I love the weather, and I do weather videos. Um, I am currently studying a, a hurricane that is uh, potentially heading in in this direction. If that does occur or interfere with uh, the tournament, hopefully it does not, uh, but we will reschedule the tournament. We already have the trophies made, everything is set. We will reschedule the tournament for a date in which we can all agree on or the majority thereof, uh, but hopefully we don't have to deal with uh, another storm here on Dolphin Island, it gets rough. Okay, so we have uh, a handful of players too that are playing their first tournament ever. Okay, so I won't get into who, but um, but we, we wish them a lot of luck in joining the tennis community. They've worked hard, right, as students, and they're going to play their first tournament. Uh, lastly, Blakely Prime, we, we love you a lot. She, she's an active member and a heck of a good player. She's a, a USTA certified referee, right? So, you know, if there's any questions that arise during the match, as long as she's not playing, then we can always go knock on Blakely Prime's door. Uh, much love to Blakely. All right, uh, so what we're going to do is we're gonna go ahead and, and read out the match start times, okay? So I'm going to start with the division um, 6.5 to 7.5, okay? So we spend a lot of time uh, making these draws and, and, and kind of figuring out the best way to go about it because we, we didn't have an exact even number, so we had to create a couple of buys. So just one buy. Yeah, good. just what, yeah, well one buy in one division and four buys in the other division, and, and I'll tell you how that works, okay? So Friday night at 6 o'clock p.m., okay, uh, the following matches will take place. Darius and Bianca will take on Shad and Emily. Okay, good match. As well, Ruth and Matthew will take on Ella and Noah. Okay. Uh, next, Andy will play with Mary Herndon, and they will face off against Stacy and Mike Dangler. Is that mm -hmm. correct? Um, next, we will have Jack and Karen. That's his mom. It's always great to see a, 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 a mother and, and son play together. Uh, beautiful thing. Uh, playing against Mary and Joey. Okay. 
Next, we'll have Lauren and Alex, who are going to play Carolyn and Steven. Okay, good luck. Now, there's a Steven Morgan as well, and he is in the, the higher division. No, he's not playing. Oh, he's not playing. That's right. See, I'm thinking about you, Steven. Think, thinking about you. Okay. All right, so Carolyn and Steven will face off against Lauren and Alex. Um, next match will be Kevin and Julie, husband and wife team. Let's go. Come on. We'll face off against Carly and her husband, Daniel. Let's go. Uh, last match in this division for Friday will be Riley and Lily Morgan. Lily Morgan is one of our students and Bryant, a uh, tennis player. Um, Riley and Lily Morgan will face off against Liliana, my daughter. Uh, and Kenny Daughtry. So that should be an exciting time. So those are the first round matches. The players with buys. Now there's four players with buys. There's so, one player with buy. First. Oh, that's the next one, yes. yes. One player with the buy, and this team will not play until uh, Saturday morning, and we'll get the match times. You know, if it doesn't quite work, we can work it out. But I'm thinking around 10 a.m. on on Saturday morning, okay? That would be Patrick and Leanne. That's, that's the one who got the buy. We felt like they were the best team, given the kind of... The layout, they're a strong team. So we said, okay, we'll make them the one seed. Um, and Patrick and Leanne will face off on Saturday morning against the winner of Darius and Bianca and Shad and Emily. And that'll happen Saturday morning at 10 o'clock, okay? So that's that. And, and the rest of the matches moving forward, we'll talk about the tournament desk and we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Let's have a chill weekend, right? Good luck. I can't wait. Uh, okay, so the next division is 8.0 to 8.5. And there's a lot of strong teams here, all of them. Um, there's going to be a, a, a lot of action for sure here. By the way, every time we do a tournament, I try to, if I can kind of squeeze it in, to film the final, right? And then kind of play by play. Oh, that's a nice shot of the line, that type of thing. So I like to have fun with it. Um, so the final of this, I would like to film. You know, if someone has a personal issue with that, then I understand. No worries, I won't film it. But I like to film it if, if possible. All right, so we had four buys for this one. Well, those okay? are your four seeds. Yeah, four seeds. So we, we went with the level of player, um, how they kind of matched up, knowing that we know all of you for the most part. And, and we created four seeds because there had to be four buys, okay? We had to choose Mark and Laura, um, at Mark Moore and Laura Russell. Russell, as the one seed because they won the tournament last time. It was the easy thing. You know, they won the last tournament. Um, they're a one seed. Carmelita and Nathan, that's Carla's dad. Um, we put as a seed in no particular order after those. Cause af after Mark and Laura, we said they won the last tournament, they're one. We'll just get three of, of the better teams and give them the bye. Um, so the other seed would be Carmelita and Nathan, Carla's father. Let's go, Nathan. Uh, another seed is going to be G Gabe, um, one of our students, and uh, Kathy, is that correct? Katie. Katie, sorry. Katie Crane. Hey, yes. Hey, I'm doing all the talking here. You want to do the talking. I do, yeah, well, anyway. We'll, we'll, we'll get to it. Okay. So Gabe and Katie Crane. What's up, Katie Crane? Um, is playing with Gabe. And the last seed is Jody, um, Katie's husband. What's up, Jody? Is playing with Mary Smith. So st four strong teams. Okay. Yeah, I went by, by their ratings, their, their, yeah. their NTRB ratings. And really, I did put one, two, three, and four. Most of these uh, guys have made the finals of one of our tournaments, and that's why I did it that way. Yeah. Okay, so the the 8.0 to 8.5 matches uh, will begin Friday night at roughly 7.30. Okay, what time are the food trucks there on Friday? Do you know? Six, I think. Six to something? Yeah. So whenever. Uh, anyway, so keep that in mind um, that, that there would be a food truck there. Okay, there are four matches in this division Friday night that will begin roughly around 7.30. And the first match will be Jeremy uh, Tapper, right? Uh, and Blakely Prime. And they will take on uh, Fabian, correct? Mm -hmm. Right? And someone that, that I really uh, have, have a lot of um, intrigue about because she, she was an Air Force pilot. She flew KC-135s. Her name is Mary, but, but I like to call her KC. But then I found out her call sign was Taz. Um, and so we'll call her Taz. So Jeremy and Blakely will take on Fabian and Taz, okay, or Mary. Okay, next match, Kenny Sands and his wife, Beth. What's up, you two? Good team. Uh, playing Ryan Mason, uh, one of our friends from Mississippi. And his partner, we've never met, Yvette. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, next, we'll have Christian Clark and Karen Sutton playing Liliana. Uh, our daughter is playing with Jack. We all know Jack, and Jack's a, a, a fine young man. But Liliana, our daughter, is playing in both divisions. So she's playing with Kenny Daughtery in one and Jack um, in, in, the, in the next division. So we wish her luck. Okay, um, then the last match of uh, Friday night, roughly at 7.30, is Reggie 
playing with Sandy. Is that what Sandy, you wrote? Yes. Reggie and Sandy playing with Adriana and Luis. Mm -hmm. Correct? Correct. Correct. So that's it. I know I rambled on and took up a, a lot, a lot, a lot of your time. Let me make sure I didn't miss any notes. Um, yes, yeah, some of you won't play your first match till Saturday. We'll um, notify you those that do not watch uh, this video. Yes. Be notified via yep. text or, or a call. Uh, that's it. I hit everything. All right, guys. Guys, good, good luck. luck. Let's go. Good luck. Come on.